right here. Oh, wait, Brown. All right, uh, menu, menu, track. Jesse's getting ready. I'm following you. Yes, and we want. Oh, I love that screen. That's why I bought it. Whew, so clear. Man down. Second man down. We got two men down side by side. I don't know what the hell that was about. <laughs> no idea what they were doing up there. Oh, they left it out there. No, 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 no. Come on. So by the way, we see a red Tacoma. That's the guy that was parked here. Oh. I wonder, I wonder if he saw us coming, thought we were going to rat on him or something and left. Red Tacoma up here when you came across? When, we, when I parked, there's a red Tacoma sitting here. Oh, so we should go fucking give him a blanket party? All right, let's have her going straight. Gonna do it all. Hand down. Man down. That's slippery. Wow. <laughs> if I can have someone just grab one of that front handlebars, I can get her up. Thanks guys. Oh, 
Look what happened here. I got caught in between these two. No. Oh. Right, hold on. It's on my knee. There we go. Where did I roll? Got it. Yeah. Yep. Thank you. Yeah. I appreciate you coming out. I'm sorry. <laughs> Low bridge. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that was very low bridge. Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful. Look at this. <laughs> you guys know how much I love vistas. I love vistas.
happen again. Oh, for sure. Absolutely. And now he's already in his head. Yeah. So. That's what sucks, because they've all just taken the class. So th that's oh. what the tape with the names. They took okay. the riding class. Oh, was that part of the class? I don't think so, but the tape on the, their names means they have taken the class. Good morning. Are we plugged in? Yeah. All right. Yeah, we're plugged in. Uh, welcome to day two of March Moto Madness. Hey, where is everyone? <laughs> well, all my friends are volunteering all day today. And um, this being my last ride of the summer, I'm not going to stay back to camp. So I'm out riding. I'm doing the Cherokee Challenge today. It basically winds around woo, uh, Cherokee National Forest and it takes about six and a half hours to do. 
and I was really um, I was really like bummed that I went to go brush my teeth my mid line and stuff I had to go brush my teeth and um, I saw a group of 12 GS riders uh, all leaving right then I said what are you guys gonna write there it's a Cherokee challenge and so I quickly brushed my teeth they probably got a 30 minute head start on me but I think with the 701, and as you know, my amazing riding skills, uh, I, I'll be able to catch them, assuming they went the correct direction. Uh, I don't know what direction they went, but this does have tracks one, two, three, four, five, so assuming they're doing them in order, I will catch those guys. And I have some riding buddies for today. Um, I like riding with GS riders because they ride the same speed as me. <laughs> I do not. Whoop. I do not like riding with KTM riders because they go way faster than me. So, yes, I'm following Cherokee Challenge myself. And whoop, uh, I'm just gonna enjoy the scenery today at my own pace. Well, we are in the National Forest, so we're doing forest roads. And uh, Jesus Christ, <laughs> that's a lot, a lot of bumps. Uh, should be a good day though. Seriously, I'm excited. I'm enjoying myself and uh, we're about 40 minutes into it right now So catch you later Oh, if you're wondering, the uh, buzzkill for the Hondo Garage Perfect Squeeze is broken again. It's my third one. Um, yeah, kind of sucks. It does. It sucks. Uh, luckily, I had the root on my Garmin. But... Yeah, you see that, I don't know if you see it or not, that cord is hanging up at the top. It just cracked off. It didn't even, like, the, the previous design, the uh, cords would actually come loose. But uh, this one lasted a year and a half, two years of this kind of riding. And it just cracked. So the other piece is still screwed into the pl base plate. But the phone was all over the place. And I know from experience, once one of these gets loose, the other three really can't handle the loads. Another one comes loose, and all of a sudden it's... Uh, some cows got out. Where are they supposed to be? Oh, there's the fence there. I won't clean the boat off the bag. Yeah, I. 
Oh, they're right there. <laughs> it's it's unfortunately it gets dirty again in five minutes. <laughs> yeah, I'm legal. I promise. Y'all take care. <laughs> show it to you tomorrow. So this is Sylvain's uh, rig. Um, and honestly, he built it himself. <laughs> it's really, really cool. I've never seen it in person actually. So it's just cool to see it like in the flesh. Um, yeah, it's, a, it's a, a Suzu, I think, cab with a super long chassis. Um, and it's all custom custom made. It's pretty cool stuff. I dropped by to see my Canadian friends, but they are uh, out riding still. So I shall continue on my track. But good to uh, oh. yeah, what a cool rig.